guys, so as you guys noticed, I haven't made any origami videos because for a long time because I completely forgot about that. But I know this the next video after the, um, what is that video? Yeah, the scented notebook one, I'm supposed to make the squishy video. But I decided to make the origami first because, like, I haven't made any one yet. So today we're going to be making the swan, which is the next one. Yeah, so let's find the paper. Okay, so the, the paper is a picture of a big flower. It kind of looks like the Rafflesia one, but I don't know. Maybe it's just a big flower and a lot of other kinds of flowers and leaves and like sakura trees, I guess. No, I don't know. So to start with, we just um, fold it into a triangle like this. Okay. And now... Once you have the line in the center, you fold it like this. This corner to the center, crease of the triangle, and repeat for the other side. Done. So it looks like this. Then you turn over and do the, the same thing as you did on the other side. Wait, let me just press down. Okay. So fold it like this. So it will look like this. This is the back and this is the front. So the next page now. Um, you'll have to fold the bottom here to this point. Okay. And now we have to wait, wait, wait. One, two. Oh, just fold this back <sighs> like this. Then you turn it around and fold it like this. And at the same time, you pull this up. And press it down. Then, you inverse, inside reverse fold, bringing upper corner down towards the lower corner pre-crease if necessary. So it looks like this. So you just have to push it in like this. Okay. And now, just wait. Let me just. Oops. Okay. <clears throat> okay. So guys, hey guys. Um. Just now we did. I did this right. That's actually wrong. You're supposed to fold the, this corner to this bottom point, like that. Then, just fo fold it backwards and press it down like this. So it's like a zigzag. And press it down. So it looks like this. So that's the tail. And now, we're going to the head. You just lift this up and press it down. So that's the head. <clears throat> and now you 
um, folds um, just a bit of the top of the beak. Not beak, not too much though. And push it in. And the next page. Now you hold it like this and just lower it down like this and just fold it like that. So it's like this. Then you fold lift this up and press the sides. So this is how your swan looks like. It kind of looks weird. It looks like a trunk. <laughs> I'd rather leave it like the, just like the head itself. But this is how this one looks like. So this is how it looks like when it's finished. So now I'm going to go ahead and color the swan. So okay. Okay, so I finished coloring it. This is how it looks like when it's finished. So it looks pretty cool. cool. Let me just put back the colors. Okay. So now we're just gonna look, take a look at the finish. Oops. Uh oh, I got the book. Okay. So here's a picture of this one in the book and this is the one that we just made so so um i hope you enjoy it and i hope you like the video and this one oh wait i think i forgot one thing the eye well you can't really see it <laughs> Okay, so, yeah, don't forget to subscribe, like, and comment below. Well, okay. So, see you next time, guys, and don't forget to subscribe. Uh, wait, I just said that. <laughs> okay, so...